In forestry, the difference between a successful fell and a fatal accident is often measured in milliseconds and millimeters. We are going to analyze 10 high-risk scenarios caught on camera. We will ignore the sensationalism and focus on the physics. Why did the hinge fail? What caused the barber chair? And how can you identify structural weakness before starting the saw? Welcome to a Lumber Logic Safety Breakdown. Wind direction, the angle of the cut, even the shape of the terrain, all of it can change everything in an instant. Let's look at this first case. This phenomenon is known as a barber chair. It happens when the tree leans too heavily during the back cut, causing the trunk to split vertically before the hinge is fully formed. Notice the speed of the split. The kinetic energy is released upward, which can be lethal for the logger. To prevent this on leaning trees, we use the bore cut technique, plunging the saw into the trunk to create the hinge first, leaving a strap of holding wood at the back to be cut last. This keeps the tension under control until the very end. Now observe this specimen. Visually, the bark looks intact, but the fall is erratic. This is a classic sign of internal decay or heart rot. When the structural integrity of the hinge is compromised by rot, you lose directional control. The standard open face notch is not enough here. A professional assessment would involve sounding the tree with an axe or taking a core sample to determine the extent of the decay before committing to a felling plan.
strong cutting position can make the trunk split early, leaving no time to escape. Some trees are so old or hollow that they break unpredictably, making their fall impossible to control. Sometimes the real danger isn't in the tree, but in the overconfidence of the one cutting it. controlled cuts to prevent wildfires. But every time a tree is taken down, it should be done with respect, awareness, and proper safety measures because nature doesn't forgive mistakes. Thanks for watching, and if you enjoyed this, make sure to subscribe for more.
Respecting the physics of the tree is the only way to ensure you go home at the end of the shift. If you want more technical breakdowns of heavy machinery and manual felling, subscribe to Lumber Logic.